How's it going, viewers? I'm Aki Simmons, and welcome to another edition to Fighting Friday. Alright, so most recently, Dragon Ball Fighters got an update. Not only can you go online, you can now go offline, making things a whole lot easier for yourself. You don't feel like going online, dealing with other opponents and all that stuff? Don't mind that noise? Well, most of spell. Like, as we are saying, you don't want to deal with online players, so you can just go offline and just do things on your own. And that's exactly what I'm going to do, since I just plan on continuing the story mode. Yeah, about my weekly Friday series, Fighting Friday, Fighting Friday is not about the story mode, but it's just about the game Dragon Ball Fighters. But because I've yet to do the story, I've decided to begin with the story. Yeah, we go offline, you are the only one here. Like, no longer will this lobby be crowded. You're just like the only one there. Like, you can do what you, you can do what you want, and just buy capsules, but we are offline, you cannot view the replay channel. You can just watch save replay. Yeah, that's like the only thing. Oh, and another thing. We are offline, you won't be able to you don't have any access to this either. Yeah, we are offline, there are no replay channels, and there's none of that. Just save replays, buy capsules, story mode, arcade mode, and local battles. Pretty much one-on-one -on -one for CPUs, and a tournament mode. It's still cool how this game has a tournament mode. But, alright, enough talk. Yeah, that was the update. Dragon Ball Fighters now has an offline lobby. And I feel like that was a very great call. Now, last time I did this, I actually completed the Super Warrior arc. But the Super Warrior arc isn't at 100%. So, I'm going to have to go back in there and try to find other things. But I'm not going to do that. Instead, I'm just going to move on to the Enemy Warrior arc. And just see what I can do here. So, without further ado, let's get this Enemy Warrior arc started. New game, please. Woo! I wonder who I'm going to use first. Enemy warrior or type one. What the? Is this the evil empire? Ooh, is that planet Namek? Or is that new Namek? Because planet Namek was destroyed. Ooh, it's Palunga. It's Androids 21 and 16! What's 16 doing with Android 21? Well, that happened. What was the wish? Or well, what were the wishes? Since Palunga is capable of granting three wishes. Holy crap! It's a butler of villains! They're all wiped out, and I guess thanks to all the wishes, they're back to life. That explains why the villains are in the game, because they've been brought back. Can you hear me? Uh, yes. Loud and clear, actually, yeah. What's up? Do I have to push a button? Yes, I have to push a button. Okay. Hello. I see you are awake. How are you feeling? Um, I'm feeling pretty alright. I got a job for Walmart, actually. Yeah. Um, quick story. Earlier today, well, no, 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 no. Long. Yesterday, since this is Fighting Friday, yesterday, on Thursday, I got a job at Walmart. I'm the real people greeter. And I'm so happy! I can get paid doing what I naturally do, and that's just saying hello. It's great. I'm not going to mention the pay, but I just want to mention that I got a job yesterday, on Thursday, and I'm, ha and I was, and I'm happy. Like, I get to finally work now. I should be beginning next week, so when it comes to my YouTube schedule, I have to figure that one out. Because when I start working at Walmart, I have to be extra focused. Like, I don't want to miss too many days 
And I don't want to be late as I approach, make my way to Walmart. Like, I have to be on time. So, when it comes to doing the YouTube stuff, I guess I just have to try to make the time to do videos. So, things are going to be a little tricky when I start working. But, yeah, I got, I got a job now. And I can't wait. But, alright. Enough of that. Let's continue with the story. Oh. Well, how am I feeling? Well, I don't want to I don't want to ignore the question, so I'm gonna say not bad. I'm feeling pretty good. Hmm. Looks like the link system is working properly then. The link system. You mean the same link system that allowed me to work with Goku, Gohan, Vegeta, and Piccolo and the others? You probably have a lot of questions, but first allow me to introduce myself. Um, sure thing, quote unquote, Mister. I am sixteen. An android created by the Red Ribbon Army. Who remembers Android 16's name? Um, shoot. Don't it? Android 17 and 18 have names, but I forget their names. One of them was Lazuli, and the other one was La something. I think Lazuli's Android 18, and Android 17 had a different name. It also starts with an L. Aw, oh, man! I thought I watched Dragon Ball Z Bridge again just remembered. Oh, and by watching Black Machine Bridge, I might see Andrew 16's name. Yeah, I'm, I, I totally blanked out. I can't remember Andrew 17's name. But I'm pretty sure Andrew 18's name is Lazuli. What the heck was Andrew 17's name? Darn it, I had it memorized until this moment. We don't have much time, so I'll be brief. Um, okay, Mr. Andrew 16. Sir. Right now, you're linked with an alien named Frieza. <gasps> I am the evil emperor! Basically, it's like you've possessed Frieza's body. Yeah, um, I'm not totally new at this. I used to be Goku, and Vegeta, and Gohan, and Piccolo, and so much more. It may be easier if you just take a look for yourself. Um, alright. I'll do that. Alright, I'm on my feet. I'm walking. And there I am! I am Frieza! Being free is pretty fun, because I have a golden form. It may surprise you, but this is all real. Imagine being Frieza! How would you feel if the, if it was watching this, how would you feel if you were inside the body of Frieza? Like, would you be happy, or would you be a little concerned? We were planning to link your soul with Goku's. They never done that. But one thing led to another, and you ended up linked to Frieza. All right. Uh, I guess I can work with that. This may sound strange, but just relax. There's a way for you to return to your body. Ooh. If that's the case, then please tell me, because I would love to be back to my own. I would love to be back to my home body. It's... Hmm. Can you hear me? Whoa! Frieza? You can hear me? Then answer me. Yes, Frieza, I can hear you! Loud and clear! It seems as if Frieza's soul has awakened. Wow, Frieza. Wait. Frieza was easy to wake up. Goku took a while, but Frieza's only there. He is a smart, he is a smart man after all. Frieza can hear my voice, but only you can hear his. Okay, Frieza can hear 16, but only I can hear Frieza. Understood. Now, try saying something to Frieza. He's scary, so I'll play dumb. Nah, I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna be that kind of soul. I just wanna be a good soul. Like, I wanna greet. And get better at greeting, since greeting is greeting is my gonna be my job now. Hello, nice to meet you, Emperor Frieza. You're ill mannered, but at least you can make an introduction, which is surprising to say the least. Ill mannered? Well, curse you, man! May my may no, may no, I guess I was better off playing dumb, but oh well. Even then, I find it hard to forgive you for 
even tried to speak to me. Are you serious, Frieza? Do you really believe in your own hype that much? He called Frieza calls me ill manner for saying hello. What kind of crap is that? Alright. Intolerable! How to free Frieza! You have arrived, finally. Let's just say good evening. Another minute late. Um, okay. I don't need to explain things to her. Um, I don't think you do. I'm inside your body, and when you speak to me, I can hear you. Now then, there are several questions I have for you. Okay, Mr. Emperor Frieza, sir. Lay it, lay it on me. First, I want you to begin by explaining to me what's happening right now. Well, right now, I'm linked to your body. So, I'm in control of your body. So, whatever you're doing, it's my doing. I'm in charge of your body. I'm just glad there are no bees here, like in that end of a flower garden. Yeah, that's a little unfortunate. I don't understand. Parade? Silence, scout! Ah! Absolutely nothing about the hell I've been put through. Oh, I'm sorry! Um, okay, take it easy. Uh, okay, Frieza, sorry. I'm sorry that I decided to bring up the topic. No, 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 that's quite alright. Um, if you erase me, then how are you able to move again? I am in control of your body. You need me. No? That's okay, Frieza. Okay. Okay. I'll, I'll try again. I'm inside your body, so I'm in charge of everything your body does. Whatever you do, it's my doing. Right? You're not doing it on your own. I'm in charge because I'm the soul or the link that's linked to your body. So whatever you do, I'm doing. You can speak to me, but I'm doing all the work. Obey me, or you will regret it. I just explained it to you! Are you deaf? Frieza, can you hear me? I don't know how much you heard, but there's no time for a full explanation. I'll summarize the important points. Um... Alright, Ender 16, go ahead. By using the Link system, another soul has taken over your body. That's what I've been trying to tell Frieza, but Frieza hasn't been listening to me! You will not be able to use your power, nor will you be able to defeat enemies. <laughs> okay, enough of all these stupid jokes. I'm afraid there's no joke, Frieza. Time to get serious, or I'm going to erase you right here and now. That is enough to you! Like, if you want to erase Enter 16, you're going to have to ask me to do so. I mean, I appreciate the fact that you won't allow anyone to be in charge of you. That's definitely the way to go. But at this point, the link allowed me to link to your body. So you have no choice, Frieza. Now let's just take it easy now. No! No! Not like this! Frieza's gonna kill me! In his own body! Um, I hope so. I received no response. Are you two conversing? Yeah, we are, and I think I'm I think I'm about to be freaking vaporized. Well, I suppose there's no use in pondering it. I'll just continue with the conversation. Yes, and okay, I'm 16. You do your thing. Meanwhile, I'm just gonna try not to get killed by Frieza. What? You can attack me, Frieza. I'm a link, not a soul. Well, I am a soul, but as a link, I have no physical form. So you can't hurt me. Just so you know, going 
wild inside your mind will change nothing. Yeah, a mind is a mind. A mind is a wonderful place. Like, it is really freaking incredible. Like, yeah, in the outside world, you can see grass and the trees and the blue sky, but in your mind, you can see whatever you want to see. Like, you can imagine, you can think about so many things, and you can actually see it. Like, the mind is incredible. You just need to give it up and listen. You hear that, Frieza? There is only one way to fix this situation. Okay. Listen, you need to allow that soul to control your body and experience as many battles as possible. Alright, Frieza. You hurt the android. Let me take care of your battles. And you will soon be able to be... You soon, you will soon be able to move on your own again. Don't worry, Frieza. I don't plan on humiliating you. Not at all. I'm just doing what I have to do for now. You mean my only hope is to let someone else use my body as they please? Uh, I know it sounds terrible, but don't worry. I don't think of myself as a soul that's above you. I don't find it funny either. I find it both awkward and awesome. Now if you would, please stop standing there and give me back my money. I want my card! Otherwise, it would be my pleasure to erase you from existence. We're doing this again? No! I may not be able to do anything on the outside, but you and I are both on the inside. Stop it, Frieza! If you kill me, how will you move? How are you? How are you boxing without me? Think about that. Ass. Yeah, wait. No, help me, please. There's just no communicating with Frieza. Frieza is impossible. Like, if you can't... Don't tell me you, you, you. If you can't communicate with Frieza, Frieza will most likely drop you very fast. I'm so glad we can now finally talk to one another. But I'm not interested in hearing your excuses. Oh boy. Kill for Android 16. This Emperor Freeza he's speaking to. If he gets if he's not amused, he will kill you! The soul inside you must have handed off the control. I guess this will make things faster. Alright, as long as it makes things faster, I guess we make more progress. Enough small talk. Now, prepare to die! Yeah, see look at that. Freeza only wants to kill Android 16. He's impossible! Control over my body. Oh, um, yeah, you did, but because I'm in charge, you're not as powerful as you think you are. Now do you get it? Your only hope is to leave the fighting to the soul inside you. Listen to the android, Emperor Frieza. The power of the link allows you to move, but if it's removed... If I remove... <laughs> you are going to pay for this. Not only did you seal away my power, but you also let this creature possess me. Don't worry, Frieza. In a moment's notice, I'll be more than capable of unlocking your golden form. Just so there are no misunderstandings. I was the one that started up the linked system, but your power was sealed by a different person. Yeah. That makes sense. What? Why? Her name is Android 21, the current leader of the Red Good Army. Current leader? Alright. Farewell, Jewel. Well. If you fight a great deal and power yourself up, you may be able to stop them. Oh, so even though there's the enemy art, Android, Android 21 is the big, the big, uh, Android 21 is like the enemy. You may be able to stop her. Don't you know who you're dealing with? Yeah, this is Frieza after all. If what you say is the truth, then all I need to do is erase her. I love Dragon Ball Fighters. 
I love talking about fighters. Like, this game is so well made when it comes to the story mode. It's like watching a TV show, but you're playing a game instead. If you do that, you will never get back to normal. What do you mean? Are you trying to threaten me? Uh, don't do that, Andrew 16. Don't try to amplify these up. Only she knows how to break the seal on your soul and your power. This is truly ridiculous. Do you really think that any of this is believable? Oh, by the way, this new voice makes a great replacement for the original new voice for Frieza. Yeah, in Resurrection F, there was a new voice for Frieza, but apparently that voice couldn't make it for Dragon Ball Fighters. So, someone else was hired to be Frieza, and the voice acting is top notch. Still, at this rate, we're never going to get anywhere. Yeah, the two new voices are pretty much the same. Like, they're both that good. I hope you listen to all of that just now. Okay, Frieza, I, I, everything's, everything's fine, everything's cool. It appears that my only way out of this extremely vexing situation is to let you fight. Yes, Emperor Frieza. If you let me fight, I promise you won't lose. At all. Unfortunately, there is just no other option. From now on, you are my servant. Uh, yes, Emperor Frieza. Fight like your life depends on it, and make sure you don't disgrace me out there. Yes, sir. Don't you worry, Pisa. You will still find that I'm quite the capable soul. I said I wanted to practice, but I didn't practice at all. Oops. <laughs> Intolerable, how to free Pisa. Alright, I'm over here. And they're like, oh, and the boss is Napa. Alright, so far I don't see anyone to say. So, do I want to fight everybody? I think I want to fight everybody. Go here. And then go out to Krillin. Actually. S2. I'm only a freezer now. Actually, so what kind of stuff can I give you? No leak events, but how do I... How the mother fake do I set up the moves again? Like, how do I... Ah, there we go. Attack up. Special attack power up. Um, is Frieza more defensive or more about the health? Nah, I'm gonna make, I guess Frieza's gonna have, it's gonna have some defense. I bet he's trying to keep up a little about that. Gradually reserve makes health. Oh, alright. I will be needing that. No, yeah, I'm gonna have health regeneration instead of defense. A good offense to make a good defense. Increase the amount of health to cover after a win. Oh, no, no, no. Alright, I'm good to go. Krillin! Or Imposter Krillin! Come for you, boy. It's not my nature to, it is really not my nature to say boy like that. So I don't know why I just did that. I should focus on being who I really am. <laughs> yeah, I think with the enemy, I'm going to face every enemy in the field. Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah. Take that! That was easy. As promised, Lord Freezer, you will not lose one battle! And that sucked. I've never got any experience for that.
and it came. Level two. Heck yeah. Captain Ginyu, yup. Repair yourself. Oh yeah. It may have been a while since I played, but I'll get better in due time. As I'm speaking, I have a combo I can do. Like I only have a combo to remember. Hello. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, I know how to play now. I'm good. This is good, please, from now on. Ooh, Pickle got stronger. Oh, that's a Nappa! Alright, clones, pick a little Nappa, bring it on! Know what? Looking at all these clones, I'm gonna give me an idea for Dragon Ball Universe 2. Okay. Alright, before I do anything else, let me just... Ba bam There we go. Now I'm talking. Alright, Chloe Yamcha! Yeah, the next time I play Dragon Ball Universe 2, all my characters are gonna be clones. All my characters are gonna be clones. Like, that's what I want to do. But there's so many options with the uh, Xenoverse characters, now that you can customize them, that it's difficult to just stick with one design. Now I actually want clothes. Yeah. Now. Yeah. Yeah. Out of me. What the? Hey, another enemy! I don't know if 
fight every enemy on the field. Like, that's my goal. I mean, now 12 turns remaining, and that was right there, so I have time. But yeah, I've decided. Whenever I hop back into the universe 2, my characters are gonna be are gonna have clone colors. Goku might be the only one that doesn't have the clone colors, but I want clone colors. Yeah. Ah, Jesus! <laughs> yeah. How about this? Oh, Jesus! Oh, maybe I was in the middle. Haha! <laughs> a destructive finish. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not worried about the experience, by the way. I think I'm just fine with health regeneration. That way, when I take damage, I can get help. I can get my health back. All right, Nappa, you've gotten stronger, and I see no other enemies around. Prepare yourself. Attack power of three. Holy shoot! All right. So this enemy has an attack power of three. I'm gonna have to brace myself for this one. The plot thickens. The road to reviving Freeze. Uh, Oh my gosh, Nappa has no pupils, he's gone mad! It talks. This one seems a little different than all those other pathetic specimens. Oh, what kind of specimens, Emperor Frieza? Again, he has no pupils! Well, it may be capable of speaking, but it seems just as pitifully stupid as the others. Well then. Might as well kill a little time and display my superior strength. All right, um, no pupil Nappa. Let's do, let's do it. But he seems to have no pupils. He's gone crazy. This is your free fight. All right, Nappa. You ready for this? Here I come! Yeah. Shoot, give us a combo. Ah. That was way too easy. Alright, Nappa is now playable. But to be honest, I kind of want to stick with Frieza because Frieza is awesome. And you have the transformation too. Alright, Nappa, how you feeling? What's going on? Ah, oh, there we go, there we go. He has his pupils back. I thought you were just another Cretan, but you actually have a modicum of skill. Okay. Well, I did go a little easy on you, but you still survived my attacks. Yeah, he is a Saiyan after all. Wait, please. Is that you? Lord Frieza? In the flesh. Oh, oh. So you do know your place after all. Oh, don't be like that, Emperor Frieza. Please, forgive me. It's me, Nappa, the Saiyan. I used to work for you. Don't you remember me? Wow. Nappa. That name does ring a bell. Wow! <laughs> Their apologies, Lord Frieza! It, it just... It, you changed forms from, from when I last had the honor of meeting you. That's true. I don't think Nappa or Radix ever saw Frieza's final form. So this is new. So this is new for him. Oh, so this was the first time you've seen me in my current form then? Still... If one cannot recognize one's master, does that not constitute an absence of loyalty? 
Oh my! Oh, of course not! Come down on high water, I would do your bidding to the letter, Lord Frieza. Wow! Nappa really doesn't want to be on Frieza's bad side. I would need to test you on that statement now, would I? But if you do need it, you will devote your life to serving me. Is that clear? Man, Emperor Frieza is just that creature. <laughs> like, either work, either work for him or be destroyed. It's unfair, definitely, but it's just anime stuff. That wasn't terrible. Seems like you might have a knack for this. Thanks. Thank you, Emperor Frieza. If you can tap into a little more of my power, we should be able to interrogate Android 16. Yes, Emperor Frieza. You mad? Ah! <laughs> I feel like the Dragon Ball Z community is aware of all the people on the internet. You mad? I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna tease Lisa though. I'm just gonna say I prefer a more peaceful strategy. Silence, you. I do not care what you prefer. Okay. What could possibly be wrong with punishing a fool like him? I urge you to learn your place. What place? I am my own soul! I'll have you know. There is no doubt about it. You can't actually believe anything that comes out of that man's mouth. If so, you are a puke-inducing simpleton. Please, huh? You're so big! I don't know what his true goal is, but he must be hiding something. Like what, Emperor Fiza? Oh, I see. Now I understand. It seems like he originally intended to link you with that Saiyan after all. That Saiyan being Goku, Emperor Frieza? That Saiyan? Hey, you're talking about Kakarot? Yep. And since when have you been allowed to speak to me in that manner? Shall I remove that big mouth of yours? Oh, no, no, Lord Frieza. It was just my misunderstanding. <laughs> I thought it was the maggot inside of you speaking, Lord Frieza. <laughs> I sincerely hope that's the case. Nava, even you could prove to be an important pawn in a situation this dire. I trust you know what will happen. You don't show adequate results. Uh, um. Hang on, give me a mo Uh, no, never mind. I'm gonna keep playing. There was a call going on, and it seemed important, but I'll just call back. Of course I do, sir. I won't let you down. Now that's more like it. I expect great things from you. Why is it that Napa's so tough without Freeze up when Freeze is around? He's suddenly like an average follower. Like when, it, when an anime does it, it's hilarious. But still, it's like, why do they do that? They're their own character. And Freeze is such a jerk. You might want to speak a little more quietly, Napa. Did you say something? Is there not a thing? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> no, I, I think I'm gonna enjoy being inside Emperor Frieza's body. As a soul, by the way. How do I say, Nappa is now playable in the edit team menu. The plot thickens, the world's reviving Frieza. Okay. Captain Ginyu's the boss, but there's also Clone Tien. Call Nappa, call Yamcha, and clone Trunks. I will take them all on. Start with Yamcha. All right, um, uh, Mr. Nappa, you'll be right there. Now let me hook you up with something. Actually, never mind. This applies to all characters I use. So yeah, just that. Late to go.
Get back up there. And I'm up there. And there goes Kong Yamcha. What a way to go out. Come here. No craps. <laughs> All right, take this. Yeah. Golden Freezer wins. Hope you got a too. Awesome. All right, now Freezer is level 17. <laughs> oh, yeah. Now Piccolo showed up. All right. Nappa, you're going to take all your flow. But before do that, I'm going to go ahead and, uh, I just really want to make a call. Like, I really do. So, in the meantime, just hang in there. I know my laptop's gonna go crazy when I'm not doing commentary, but I just really have to make a call. Like, I really, really do. Like, sorry I'm doing this mid recording, but I just really have to do this. Like, I really, really don't need to. So just hang in there, and yeah, don't freak out. I'll be right back. Okay? Alright. If there are any of you who's watching this, I'll be right back.
If you see a package in your front door, don't pick it up. Apparently, according to what my mother told me, you try to open up a package, you might blow up. I can't believe it. Like, that's so dumb. Like, I don't know, I don't know whose idea that is, but apparently that's a thing. So if you see a package, don't open it up. Please don't do it. Like, don't explode. You, so, you, need to, you need to see more days. Don't explode. If you see a package in your front door, don't pick it up. Let your parents know, let your siblings know, let your friends know. Just don't pick up a package if you see one. Just don't touch it. You might, you might explode, and opening it might blow you up. Again, I can't, I don't know why that's a thing, but it's a thing. Exploding packages on uh, people's front doors is really dumb. I don't know why that's a thing, but apparently that's what's going, apparently that's what's going on. Huh. Well, enough of that bad news, it's time to continue fighting. Next up, call Napa. Alright, let's face this Clone Napa, and hopefully, as I do this, I'll be in a better mood to forget about the exploding packages. So there's somebody in this world that looks just like me, huh? Kinda creepy. Yeah, like Goku Black looking just like Goku. Whoever created this good for nothing wanna be walking away with it! I'm taking care of this guy, I'm gonna hunt down his labor and make him wish they'd never been born! Ho oh, oh. ho! Yeah, you can train yourself to see how much you've improved. Well, to see if you still got the hang of things since you've been dead ever since the very beginning of Pac-Man Z. Time to show you how powerful the real deal is. Yeah, show that clone who's boss. Let no imposter take over. There can only be one. Alright, I'm already in a better mood, but still. If you see a package at your front door, don't open it, don't open it up. It might blow up in your face or you might die. Like, I don't know why that's happening, but apparently that's happening. And it's dumb. Like, it's really, really dumb. Alright, let's do this. Alright. I know we're using nothing before. Oh, hi. Okay. Okay. Alright, I see him. He's a tough one. Alright, time for a combo. Uh, 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 yeah. Woo! And take that! Yeah. Take this! Yeah. <laughs> Alright, that was fun. Napa isn't too bad. He's a heavy hitter. He's a heavy hitter. Definitely a heavy hitter right there. Alright, please, I'll back up front. Alright, there's Trunks, and then there's TN. But before I do that, I'm taking care of the next man here. Here I come, come, pick a low! A ah! So that's good. But... I'm gonna have to do my best to not drink so much for that. Way to go! Yeah! Shoot, give us an aerial combo! Bonus, that's what I'm talking about. Woo. 
Alright, next. Turn 14, turn 13. Turn 12. Alright, Charles, prepare yourself. Clone Charles, that is. Freezer is awesome. Like Goku and Vegeta may have Super Saiyan Blue, but they don't transform into Super Saiyan Blue. They just become Super Saiyan Blue. But Freezer here, he actually transforms into another form, and I like it. Alright, you TN clone, you're up! I hope you're ready! Up. First you 
And then he ignores Lord Frieza's direct command? It does seem that you forgot your place under me. When you fix that odd little posing habit of yours. Alright, Captain Ginyu, what's going on? What's this about? My dear Captain, I'll see to it you remember who follows the orders around here and who will be the one giving them. Wow, like, Frieza has so many people to work with. I think he's well off just doing things by himself. Like, if Frieza wants to get things done, he ought to do it himself. He ought to do it, to do it himself. Yeah, it's nice to have people to work with, but Frieza is just having, just have people that's working under him. That does get a little tiresome. Oh Jesus! Oh Jesus! And how's this? Yeah! Woo! Come here! Uh -oh. Ow! Ow! Yeah! Sayonara, Captain! Alright, Captain Ginyu is now playable. And if he's about to fall off, I believe. Mm. Alright, who's, who's, who's doing all the manipulating that allows these people to talk back to Frieza and whatnot? Whatever your excuse may be, I cannot accept insurrection in the ranks. Uh-uh. However, I'm willing to let it slide just this once, as I am in need of able-bodied fighters. Alright! Captain Ginyu, you may rise now. You won't die. Do you really mean that? I do. But in exchange, I expect you to serve me until your dying breath. Ah, uh, that's a bit... Kind of sucks. Thank you, Lord Freezer. You have my word. I promise I won't let you down again. Be sure to keep that. Listen up. The merciful Lord Frieza has given us a chance to return to his army. Now we will express our eternal joy and gratitude in the form of a death. You really need to bother. Haha, <laughs> Frieza, like, yeah, you're not doing any of that crap. Oh, oh, as you wish, my lord. Oh, Captain Gear actually stopped. Pardon my asking, Lord Frieza. I see your point, but in my army, all that matters is results. And when you get results, you really can't complain. Yeah, and that was like, yeah, they may be back to normal, but aren't they better off not doing poses? <laughs> I find that part was hilarious. Alright, well, before I do anything else, I'm going to go ahead and end things off here. One more time, it does a package at your front door. Do not touch it. Do not open it. It will blow up. It's stupid, but apparently that's what the world is allowing now. If you enjoyed this video, you can go ahead and click the like button for me. If you'd like to see my channel, please subscribe. This click more views are on the way. Count on it. Later, viewers. And stay safe out there.